What an absolutely unbelievable wedding we have here tonight. Can we get a round of applause? Please. Allison, you look absolutely beautiful. And Joe, you did pretty good too. Can you guys just believe we are the last wedding of a meddler daughter? I remember when dad took 15 minutes to talk about his first daughter and how difficult it was to marry his first daughter off. And then about 10 months ago, which most of you were there, at my wedding, where he named every single family member we had. Rachel, uh, what is he gonna talk about what tonight? What is he gonna talk about? What is he gonna do? What is he talking about? Well, Nat, what? you know. Do it's I? finally his chance to talk about his favorite daughter. <laughs> we got facts. <laughs> Here are all the reasons why. So, you know, we always have a big family. You embraced our, our large family. You also never had sisters. And you were stuck. <laughs> with Natalie and Rachel. <laughs> and you still want to marry Allison. What really makes this emotional is uh, this is the last wedding Teresa and I have to pay for. <laughs>
goodbye All those pretty things that sparkle and shine I call upon all you present to stand, to bow your heads, and offer a silent prayer for these two. Make me feel nothing like I feel when I look in your eyes. All I need is you. I call upon these mountains and valleys upon the blue heaven above to be witnesses to this renewal of sacred vows. All I need is right in front of me. I don't need much, but I need you. And I call upon our friends. Joseph and Allison to stand tall now and to lift each other up by professing your undying love and fidelity for as long as you both shall well, live. They don't mean I do. Them. I do. But whoever loves me, love my dog too. <laughs> talk to if you wish to love that person, you have to love the part of them that doesn't always behave the way you might want. The part of them that can be a little hard to handle, a little messy. You have to love their dog. Joe is one of the smartest, determined, caring guys I know. Allison, you were the perfect partner for Joe. Not long ago we talked, and I said, hey, Allie, what piques your interest in a guy? What kind of guy do you like? What you said, Allison, is that I want a relationship and meet a guy that have a, the same relationship that you and mom have. If you share with Joe just a fraction, of the unconditional love you've shown your mom and me, you're well on your way to a loving, blessed marriage. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> <laughs>